What I have for you is a quick video on NFC, which stands for Near Field Communication, and it uses Android Beam between devices to transfer pictures, files, uh, data, music, uh, video, web pages, uh, maps, Google Maps, whatever, between one device to another, So, and vice versa. You can do it with either or once you have NFC enabled. Real quick, I want to go over the devices that I'm using. This is the latest tablet from Google. It is the Wi-Fi only tablet. It is the Google Nexus 7 2013 second generation tablet. It's the 32 gig model and it's running Android version 4.4.2. This is the Nexus 5 16 gig black version and this is also running Android um, KitKat 4.4.2. So both devices are, are very similar, same OS. And I'm going to go in, we'll start with this one. I'll show you guys how to enable NFC and we'll get started with the video. So you want to go into your, your settings on the phone and go to more, okay? Right there you'll see NFC, allow data exchange uh, when the phone touches another device. You want to enable that, so give it a minute there, and it turns on Android Beam, and it says ready to transmit app content via NFC. Okay, so this device is enabled with NFC, and we're going to do the same thing on the tablet here. Go in to more. And there you'll see it. Same thing on both devices. Give it just a minute to turn on. Okay, Andro Android Beam came on there, ready to transmit app content via NFC. So both devices are ready. We'll start with this Nexus 5, and I'm going to go ahead and take a picture of Andy here. Get out, to, get out of video mode there, and we'll get into picture mode here, and we're going to take a snapshot. So there he took a picture of uh, Andy, and there he is. So what, what we want to do now, all you got to do now is take your devices and right about where the X is at, I'd say centered up. Um, this one's also in a case, and it's a Sadio case, so this works through the case. Okay, so just center them up about, you know, dead center. You know, I'm, I, I think I do it like X to X, okay? So the X is somewhere right about here. So, well here, let's just hold on until I get this in the right orientation so you guys can read what it says. Okay, so what you want to do is just center them up. You'll get touch to beam, okay? All you got to do is touch the picture, hold them together, flip it over and look at your other device. And you can see the arrow right there for the incoming beam and a progress bar there to keep us happy as it goes across until it's done. So we'll give this a second. All right, beam complete. Okay, so all you got to do is touch the notification, and there's your picture. That is the picture that I just took. So what this does is it creates a folder in your gallery. Um, we'll let it focus up here. It creates a folder in the gallery called Beam, okay, and that's under the regular gallery there. So in other words, if you go into your uh, gallery app, you will see the folder called Beam. I also have another app that I'll share with you guys that I use called FX that I downloaded for free. You touch FX and um, FX lets you see, um, let's go back in there real quick. FX lets you view all the uh, files on your system. See, you can see main storage, all the files. So go into main storage and it also creates a folder called Beam. So there's my picture. So there's a couple different ways there you can get to the picture as it physically does copy to the device. So let's go ahead and get to a, a video here and show you how long it takes to do a video. I'm just going to do a, a short video here on uh, the little Andy here spinning around on his back. So we'll go ahead and um, start recording. Wish I had a little music to go with it, but he does that pretty good. All right, so there I made a video, okay, and there's the video. Now, all you got to do now, touch to beam, as you can see, touch the video, and get this spun around in the right orientation so you can see. You want to keep holding your devices together, and you'll get that arrow. And you can see where it says incoming beam. Okay, so 
you can see how much slower it is with the video and how, how long it takes. Like I said, I'm just simply setting this right on top of the other one, holding them together. It definitely takes, I mean, that was just a short video, so you can see it kind of takes a little while there. If any of you guys are wondering, I'm using the Nexus 4 phone to do my video. And the cameras on these phones, all the Nexus devices, really need some improvement. As you can see, it's having some trouble uh, focusing, but I really think that they could do a better job with that. I mean, the, the devices are really great, and I appreciate um, how fast they are and solid, but they need to do some camera work. Because, I, I mean, they're, they're nice to make videos with, and I enjoy making videos with them, but they need to get, like, much faster focusing and imaging rates. So, now it's about halfway done. I mean, that was probably what a uh, very, very short video, but you can see how long it's taken. Incoming beam. kind of cool. This also is going to be the new thing for contactless payments. So I think this is going to become, NFC is going to become a lot more popular. Kind of like those QR codes. Almost done. Beam complete, touch to view. So I'm going to set down the Nexus 5 and I'm going to touch... And there, it automatically starts playing the video. Wish I had a little music to go with it, but he does that pretty good. So there is the video. And if you go into your gallery, into Beam, you can see where it put the video and the picture that I took inside the, inside the gallery there. Okay, and like I said, this works from this device to this device. You can also, you, know, you can go in here to, um, let's... Let's open up the map program. And of course, there's Google Maps. And if you if you uh, simply put them together, let me get it in the right orientation, kind of hard. With it, there it goes. Okay, so touch the devices, and then touch to beam, and that opens up maps over here. So it works just like that, guys, and so on. Same with YouTube web pages and the rest of um, files, data, whatever you guys want to uh, play around with. But anyway, that's all I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. That is the uh, NFC. And go in and try it out. Enable yours. Good luck to you guys. Thanks a lot for watching my video. Please subscribe, like, comment, and I'll catch you guys later.